six public sector trade unions at the High Court to challenge the government's imposed change on how they review pensions. Unite Assistant General Secretary Gail Cartmel explains the impact it will have on ordinary public sector workers and also about the wider campaign to protect public sector pensions. The measures introduced by the Chancellor in June to change the inflation protection that all pensions have to have um, means a 15% cut to the benefits that members of the public sector and private sector schemes will draw in the future. And I introduced the private sector because some private sector companies have introduced the consumer price index in place of the retail price index. And the calculation is that there's about 1.2% difference between the two, and that's how we came at the uh, amount of 15% less. Well, our members, quite honestly, are saying enough is enough. If you take into account pay freezes and cost of living increases, a health visitor over two years is £3,000 worse off. That's just one example. And this pension grab is really, for many members, the last straw. We have a pension calculator on the Unite website, and any member can check the cost of these combined changes to their own personal pension. And many, many are very shocked. My message to members is make it the biggest, biggest protest to send a very strong message to government that their pensions are not up for grabs.